focus with 60 years under his belt as a curler, Tawasin resident, 97-year-old Jack Logan is still in the game. Jack has a great game. He does very well, holds his own. He plays twice a week, still bond spiels, at least uh, two or three times a season, along with his uh, fellow 90 plus year olds. He likes to sit back on the, uh, up in the ice chip lounge at the end of a game and have a, a rum and coffee, joke with the boys and talk about their game. Yep, no, uh, no. How has curling changed for you over the years? Well, it's, it's changed quite a bit. Normally when you curl, and all of the good curlers still do. They throw the rock, eh? You mm -hmm. bend down, you can probably be able to notice some of them doing that now. Uh, bend down and throw, throw the rock. Ooh, hit, 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 hit. Good. So you got to keep up with but, the young guys now? Well, we try to, and that's with this stick. That just only started about uh, 15 years ago uh, when somebody introduced this. Ooh. And it's brought a lot of a lot of people back to curling that wasn't weren't able to because of knee problems and hip problems and that sort of thing. Hey, we made it. Betty probably showed you everything you know, right? Uh, <laughs> of course. Well, we, <laughs> I try to remember things. <laughs> we both started in 1959 when the club, our club back east, opened. There, Skip's first rock wicks in for shot and is well protected. Married 70 years? Seven zero. Well, yeah, I'll be 70 in, 70 in November. Can you tell me what makes a successful marriage? Because most of us don't know anymore. You figure things out. You don't go to bed and mad at everybody. And you just figure things out. OK. The secret is to get the right weight. <laughs> Not as fast. They curl twice a week. Um, full house of guys here today, 48 uh, fellows out curling, and the majority of them also volunteer for our school program. So not only do they curl, but they mentor school kids and teach them the game of curling as well. Jack and his team have won the 80 and over championships in his area twice. I'm Leah Bolton. You're watching a Fraser Focus. Stay with us.